Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. So now, the allegations against Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are not coming from me, but from a seasoned royal expert, Charles Ray, former royal correspondent for The Sun. Ray, appearing on GB News, spared no punches as he dismantled the couple's recent complaints about their supposedly awful life. The timing of this critique couldn't be more apt as the royal family, led by King Charles and Queen Camilla, released Christmas photos, projecting an image of normalcy despite the recent tumultuous events. Ray minced no words, mockingly stating, it's awful for them and their 11 million pound home with their 100 million pound Netflix contract, so it's hard for them this time of year. The sheer sarcasm in Ray's tone is palpable as he highlights the stark contrast between the Sussex's complaints and the extravagant lifestyle they currently enjoy. But the real hammer comes down when Ray addresses Prince Harry's legal battles against the British government, particularly the fight over his security detail. Ray dismisses the notion that King Charles will be emotionally blackmailed by his younger son, calling Harry's argument ludicrous. He goes on to debunk Harry's claim that bringing his family back to the UK is too dangerous, pointing out the irony that they currently reside in one of the most criminally dangerous countries in the world. Ray doesn't stop there. He dismantles Harry's assertion that he was forced to leave the royal family, labeling it as another ridiculous claim. According to Ray, the late queen had expressed her desire for Harry and Meghan to play a key role within the royal family. It was, in fact, their own choice to leave, a decision that Ray suggests was driven by Harry's desire to escape the royal circus and earn his own money. But here's the kicker. Ray shines a spotlight on the glaring hypocrisy in the Sussex's pursuit of privacy. He asserts, I mean, they continually invade their own privacy with everything they do. It's a damning indictment of a couple that has consistently sought the limelight, even as they cry foul over their perceived lack of privacy. The court hearing, just one of the five legal cases Harry has pending, is portrayed as part of a larger pattern of behavior. Ray dismisses Harry's safety concerns as a thinly veiled excuse, highlighting the irony that a prince who once bemoaned the paparazzi's intrusion is now living in a country notorious for its criminal dangers. In conclusion, the royal palace, through the words of Charles Ray, has fired back with a vengeance, challenging the narrative spun by Harry and Meghan. The veneer of victimhood is peeling away, revealing a couple whose actions speak louder than their words. Get lost. You've done enough. A sentiment that resonates with those who are growing weary of the Sussex's apparent contradictions and relentless pursuit of the spotlight. So what do you think about this news, guys? Thank you for tuning in to today's discussion. As always, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Stay tuned for more updates on the intriguing world of royalty. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Thank you.